Earlier this month, the South Korean Unification Ministry released a report on the reality of the North Korean economy and society based on testimonies of more than 6,000 defectors. Minister Kim Yong ho says it's K-dramas that are driving people in North Korea to want to leave the regime. Our North Korean affairs correspondent Kim jong shi sat down with him. While K-dramas have fans around the world, there are also those watching in secret, in hiding in North Korea. Fans in other countries may admire the unique plots, dramatic twists, and of course, the actors. But for some people in North Korea, watching K-dramas led them to a decision that could cost them their lives. The report suggests that more than 83 percent of North Korean defectors watched South Korean dramas when they were in the North. When they watch South Korean dramas, they can feel that South Korean society is free and wealthy. And the reality of South Korea in these dramas is different from what the North's regime has brainwashed its people to believe. Stairway to Heaven, My Love from the Star, and Autumn in My Heart, classics for K-drama fans, were among those frequently mentioned. The number of defectors last year was about three times higher than in 2022. It was 196 people, and about half of them were the MZ generation of North Korea in their 20s and 30s. The number proves that K-dramas have a big impact on young people in the North. The spread of K-dramas actually poses such a threat to the regime that back in 2020, Pyongyang made a stricter law that bans North Koreans from watching it. Those caught spreading K-dramas could now even face the death penalty. With the regime tightening its already tight controls, the actual lives of the residents aren't getting better. The report says seven out of ten people said they had not received any food rations from the state since Kim Jong-un became leader. A whopping 38.3 percent said they have never been to a hospital. And almost no one in North Korea has ever used the Internet. Surely, I think leader Kim Jong-un also knows the suffering of the residents and that this, if this continues, the regime isn't sustainable. Um, where is he heading with this? I think if the Kim Jong-un regime doesn't give up on developing nuclear and missile programs, it'll fall into a military dilemma. If the regime keeps spending its resources on nuclear missile development, the economic hardships within North Korea will get worse. And people's feelings will be against the regime even more. Can doubt feel the minds of North Korean people? The report says this is already happening and the number of doubters is increasing. 56.3 percent of the respondents who have recently defected said they feel negative about the succession planning that keeps power within the Kim family. What's the reason for South Korean government to let the international community know the reality of North Korean residents? North Korea's poor human rights situation and security issues cannot be separated. So to bring righteous changes in the North Korean society would help not just its residents, but also help bring peace on the Korean Peninsula, Northeast Asia, and for the world. The minister added that North Korean residents would wish to reunify not with China nor Russia, but with South Korea. And that Seoul will continue to strive for reunification that guarantees peace and freedom. Kim Jong-sil, Arirang News.